Noob Noob, I heard that you have some tears. My tears on my sweaty balls. Of the kingdom? My ball kingdom. Zelda? Kingdom of my balls. <laughs> That's right, friends. We're here to talk about Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, available for the Switch. Nintendo Switch. Nin not the Nintendo Switch Pro, because they refuse to release that. It's not on the S S Switch Pro? No, it's just on the Nintendo Switch. The same graphical power of the, the original Switch that came out years ago. So if you put it on the Six Pro, years ago, does it look better? Does it? No, there is no Pro. That's not, wait, so your Pro is just a paperweight? No, what do you mean? There, There is no Nintendo. Can you play it, it, it on the Pro? It doesn't exist. Oh, there is no Generation 2. Correct. Gotcha. There's just the OLED one where the, the graphics look the same, but they're a little brighter. Got so it. That's, but you have that. I do have that, yeah. Okay. I have the Splatoon edition. It's neat. It's, <laughs> I'm sure you played a lot Su of Splatoon. Super neat. I don't own I don't Splatoon. <laughs> You don't even so, know. Oh, okay. What's your review of Splatoon? It is colorful. 10 out of 10. Love it. The best. I like it better than Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, well, there's a, the, there's a thing. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, I am Z, and this is Noob Noob, and we're from Our Reviews Will Kill You, and we're reviewing. We I'm not reviewing Tears of the Kingdom because I've never played it. I didn't even I'm play Breath of the Wild. It. Because I have a bone to pick with it because it sucks. You have a bone-er to pick. It, well, it, it, it doesn't suck. I, I hate it more because everyone loves it. And they uh -huh. shouldn't. They really shouldn't. But like you Zelda's, can, like use a horse. You, can, you could do that six years ago. And there's a glider, I think. You could do that six years ago. Well, I have heard that you can assemble your own weapons. You could basically do that six years ago. Really? You could make your own robot that spits out fire from his crotch? I don't know if you could do that specifically, but <laughs> you, you could do enough of it to not warrant 70 goddamn dollars. It is why, expensive. Why is this $10 more than any Switch game ever in existence? Oh, when really? It's, it's, it's more expensive yeah. than every Switch game? I'm pretty sure this is the most... It's It's a price increase on the Switch. That's the first time it's happened, I think. Oh, so yeah. they know they've got you by the and Nintendo's the like grundies. we're gonna do this on a per game basis. Basically, they're gonna do it if you whatever gonna... if they think it's expensive. Yeah. So the next Mario game is coming out at like ninety dollars a pop because of this billion dollar movie. Right. That seems disturbing. Yeah, it's it's just listen. Zelda's great. I like Breath of the Wild. I played Breath of the Wild. It, it's it's cool. really enjoyed it. I didn't. Well, it's did a, it's, it's it? okay. I did not. Oh, okay. I got bored with it. Mm -hmm. The problem with me is there was a little too much freedom because I just ran you around. You don't know what to do. I ran, ran around. Like, I need. Uh -huh. I need direction, and I just ran around crafting things, mainly poor food items, which which Link would eat and then get sick and throw up. <laughs> and then eventually, I was just like, "Well, I guess I'll play Pokemon." And would you like to behold? Is there a flamethrower penis? There is. Oh my god! I did not get to that part. No, <laughs> you'd be more excited if you. Saw I would it, be very. You? If you led with this, if you would pay ten dollars more for the flamethrower penis and you start the game with it, I'd be in. Mm. I'd a find that valuable. Fire glory hole. F yeah, fi fire it looks glory like hole. a robot thing you can make. Oh, there it is. Oh, and uh, I don't know if it's helping or hurting Link. What is? What is it? A little doing? bit of both. It's a, it's a little bit of both. Why he activates it by shooting it in the hole. Listen, the, the, here's the thing. Breath of the Wild came out right when the Switch came out, six years ago. Tears of the Kingdom looks the fucking same six years after. It's a launch game for the Nintendo Switch, Breath of the Wild. Mm -hmm. You're saying six years after a launch game, you're not going to make leaps and bounds graphical improvements the map is largely the same it's the same map now granted there they added a bunch of stuff to it so that's fine they added layers to the map but for the most part map is largely the same graphics are largely the same but it's tears the mechanics of the kingdom the mechanics are largely the same they have literally trotted out 85 percent of the same game as six years ago which is a launch title game 
for an outdated system, and you're charging me ten. So you're annoyed dollars about, more. You're so you're mad about the ten dollars, but you'd rather ten buy shekels. a brand new system. Fuck yeah! You'd rather shell out. Like I would spend four hundred dollars to then spend eighty dollars. <laughs> On this upgraded pro version of Tears of the Kingdom. Just to complain about it. Just to say it looks neat because I stopped playing it three hours in. <laughs> exactly. That's, so That's how that would go. Everybody else seems to be giving it 10 out of 10, but there's somebody who seems to agree with you. Gfinity. Whoever right. that is. It's not Infinity and L. No, it is not. Because he is too busy slaying some penguins in the Netherlands. Is he going to review this? I doubt it. He's too poor. He's too poor to afford yeah. the new one. I, but this one, they their review is The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. If you haven't, if, if you have yet to step foot in the open world of Hyrule, Tears of the Kingdom is the best way to experience it with just enough new ground to keep things mm -hmm. interesting. But if you didn't gel with the 2017 re release, the story alone might not be worth the second attempt. Huh. It seems like they might uh, be agreeing with you on some level. Yeah, you I, and Gfinity. I don't necessarily agree with the six out of ten either. I think that's you too think it's low. low. That's too low. I think an eight out of ten is a perfect score because it, it's still a great game. Zelda's a great game. Everyone's gonna love Zelda who likes Zelda. You're not gonna not like Zelda if you're a fan of it. But it's just not doing enough new things to warrant its endless praise. But like, if it's a great game, why would you change? a great game it's six years it's a make, must make play. something make some sort of if if gta gta 5 is a widely loved success mm -hmm. if on the ps5 gta 5 released on the ps3 mind you if on the ps5 gta 6 releases and it looks the goddamn same people are gonna be upset nah. if you can't shoot a man in a convenience store looking a little better than you can 10 years ago then I'm going to be upset. I'm going to want to see some blood splatter. Good. Like, I'm going to want to see some kneecaps popped. I'm going to want some graphical improvements. I'm going to have game. to have you look at that game. That's the uh, the the really authentic like looking game. That looks like it's in real life. Let's see if you actually like Breaking that. news, by the way. Oscar Mayer is changing its name to the Wienermobile for the first time nearly a century. Just wanted you all to know that. Uh, okay. <laughs> that is a fact. The Wienermobile is no more. Y'all right there. It's now the wiener wagon. Well, that's a thing too. Might so be. the Metacritic has it at 96 with a user score. Too high. 8.7. Too high. That's must play. That's more along the lines of what I'm agreeing with. Eight point like eight to eight point five. That's fine. Mm hmm Cause it's a good game. It's got good mechanics. It's got a good it's got good everything. They just didn't change enough. Well, Breath of the Wild version 1.1 gets one point less due to it being the same game released again. Another point off for killing the Zelda series. Zelda is no longer its own entity. It's a generic open world gather crafty with Legend of Zelda skin slapped on it. Woo! A lot of sevens and fives. and That's Metacritic? Yeah, these are user scores. These oh. are what the people are saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like people are not as the like, Nintendo fanboys are blowing their loads to this, whereas like a normal person playing this game would be just telling you that this is the same game. So you could... far, I can't shake the feeling that this game is literally just Breath of the Wild with from a parallel dimension. So much of right? it's thematically, exactly. mechanically, or aesthetically the same, reskinned as a sequel. Some of the new stuff I like, some not so much. Fingers crossed that the story is better and more substantive this time around. Too early to tell. So what do you think of your original playthrough? Do you feel like there's enough new crafting? I I think the crafting is sufficient. Uh-huh. Um, I'm not sure about the, the intricacies of it, obviously. What about ri riding that horse in the I first I did, level? I did ride my horse from uh -huh. Breath of the Wild, which you can import. Uh-huh. Oh, um, you can import your horse from Breath of the Wild. Named him Lil Sebastian. Uh huh. That's a Parks and Rec reference. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, I love riding my donkey. Uh -huh. And, um, you know, he gets good gallops in. He eats Starting a lot of carrots. Starting to suspect something about this. What are you, what are you talking about? Mm -hmm. do, do you, in fact, own Tears of the Kingdom? Why would you need to own a game to review it? That's Did silly. you rent it from Blockbuster? I, I tried. Blockbuster is no longer in existence oh, other than in Oregon, okay. I think. So have you, in fact, <gasps> played Tears of the Kingdom? Now, when you kingdom? say play Tears of the Kingdom, <laughs> define that specifically. Did you, in fact, pick up a controller 
insert yourself into the game and play it. No, what I did was play Breath of the Wild six years ago uh-huh. and just assume it's the same game. Right, and yeah. you, d- you took this... Based on intense research. From what was your source? Um... Where Metacritic, me, uh huh. What about all those? All Gfinity, those, all those reviews that yeah. you read. Uh-huh. IGN, they IGN gave it a ten, gave it a 10 they, out of ten. They gave it a ten, but I watched the video. I'm like, that looks the same. Uh huh. That so looks very went, similar. You went strictly from watching their gameplay. Very video. similar. Wow. 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 Well, what did you think? Do you think that this game is terrible? Do you think it's a six? Do you think it's a seven? Did you actually play it? Are you willing to pay the extra $10 plus an extra $350 to put it on a Switch Pro? Let us know in the comments below. We'd like to know because we read all your comments. Read them all and pay attention. And reply. And we will give you some snarky comments right back. Uh, But be sure to check out our full-length live action action podcast. Live audio. Live audio. Live streaming here on YouTube. You can also catch us rumbling and bumbling. It's also audio version. iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, all those places and more. Because we love you and they are free. But from all of us here, our views will kill you to all of y'all at home. We love all y'all. We thank you. But we are on to the next one. Eventually. Perhaps now. Ah.